What is going on guys? Grave here today. Let's talk about the three new mythic items that will be available in the Necrom chapter. The first item I would like to talk about is going to be one of the new amulets, so a new necklace that's going to add 4,968 offensive penetration and also increase your damage done to monsters by 15%, critical damage by 15%, and reduce your light and heavy attack damage by 99%. This is kind of an interesting sounding mythic. I'm not sure exactly how a lot of people will use this, but I definitely think it could be used in some way. But reducing your light and heavy attack damage by 99% is going to be kind of, it's kind of an interesting take on a mythic item. The next thing we'll talk about, of course, is a new pair of heavy legs or a pair of greaves. While you are above 33% stamina, reduce your damage taken by 50% and lose 1,567 stamina whenever you take direct damage up to once every 0.5 seconds. So you're going to have a good bit more health. You know, you're going to be able to reduce that damage taken by 50% unless you take a direct damage attack. And then at that point you will lose stamina. You may see some tanks try to use this because if you can keep your stamina above 33%, you're going to have a good, you know, half of your damage taken is going to be reduced as long as you don't take a direct hit. So that one could be fairly useful, I think, in some scenarios. And last but not least, there will be a new light chest. You can no longer cast ultimate abilities. Instead, casting an ultimate ability transfers your ultimate resources to your living group members, divided equally among them. Gain minor heroism at all times. Now this is, I don't know why this seems very interesting to me. I'm not sure if it would be useful all the time. It may be a certain scenario type thing. Once people get to using it in the public test server, once Necrom has released and people may figure out some way they want to run, you know, certain, maybe the new trial or, you know, older dungeons or trials, they may figure out a way to use this to where it would be useful in some fight scenarios. I don't know if it would be useful all the time. I'm kind of curious about this one because it does seem kind of a, an interesting idea to replace your ability to cast ultimates. Uh, this is also kind of in the developer notes, you will not be able to proc other sets that rely on casting ultimates. So I think they kind of went ahead and took that in, in account that some people may kind of make a build, you know, would proc some sets that use ultimates. So that's kind of been taken out as well. But I do think that is, is kind of a interesting take on really all three of these, um, new mythic items, especially the light chest and kind of dividing that among your living group members, the heavy legs, like I said, I could see some, maybe some tanks finding a way to use that where you're getting 50% uh, re reduction to damage as long as you're not taking direct damage. When it comes to the amulet, I'm just not sure that more offensive penetra uh, penetration and an increase to damage done to monsters and crit damage is really going to be that big of a benefit. If your heavy and light attacks are getting, or your damages were getting reduced. There still may be some ways that you could use that, but I think out of the three, the heavy legs and the light chest are probably the most interesting to some players, but we never know. You, know, you don't know exactly what will happen during the public test server. As the weeks go on, some of these things may get changed or tweaked. So, of course, I'll make some updated videos if that happens. But leave me a comment with your thoughts. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.